day friends and welcome now back to the channel and i hope we're all having a wonderful time i hope we're following up with all the classes and we'll continue to do the best please remember to like our content share our content subscribe to our channels you know and tell people about what we do so that that will encourage us to even do more now today we are talking very quickly about nervous coordination what's nervous coordination nervous coordination talks about the process through which the nervous system controls everything everything that the human being does you know touching feeling running reacting to stimulus all of this is done through the control of the nervous system and this makes the nervous system very important now the nervous system works with a network of electrical and chemical signals so this is important and it regulates a lot of all that we do both voluntary and involuntary actions you know pulling your hand away from a hot substance you know um, being able to run, being able to respond to stimuli, response to heat, response to cold. You know, all these responses are being coordinated by the nervous system. And this is important to note. Now, the nervous system is in two major types. You know, there are two components now, not types, two components of the nervous system. And these two components are the central nervous system and the peripheral nervous system. Now, the central nervous system consists majorly of the brain and the spinal cord. The brain and the spinal cord are what makes up the um, central nervous system. Now, the second component is the peripheral nervous, um, nervous system, PNS. And the peripheral nervous system is made up of all the other nerve endings and networks apart from the brain and spinal cord. So every nerve cell, every nerve ending, every nerve connection from every other part of the body that comes you know, and joins to the spinal cord, all of these nerve endings make up the peripheral nervous system. So these two components are what makes up the nervous system and this is important to know the nervous system it initiates a lot of responses you know if you the urge to use the toilet it's the nervous system that is giving you that information the brain has processed information and sent it to you you feel the urge to drink water you feel the urge to do different processes this is what the nervous system does for us and this is very important even muscle twitching you know our eyes blinking swallowing all these things are regulated by the nervous system and when the nervous system begins to malfunction, it begins to become a serious problem. Now, there are nervous disorders that come when the nervous system doesn't function the way it's supposed to function. And it becomes really problematic. We have um, conditions such as Alzheimer's disease, Parkinson's disease. These are all diseases that come forth when the nervous system is not working correctly. And when this uh, happens, the person it becomes difficult for the person to do many activities, to move his hands, move his legs engage in different different activities becomes very difficult because the nervous system has begun to malfunction it affects the person's ability to think to move to talk everything is affected by the nervous system so this brings us to the end of our class today this is just the part one of the nervous system we'll continue where we'll talk about the brain and every other section of the nervous system thank you for listening and have a wonderful day